Hello friends, welcome to Zappy's Fruit Stand. I have so many different kinds of yummy fruits here. Can you help me count how many fruit I have before I open up? Great, thank you so much. Do you know what fruit this is? You're right. Here we have a yummy apple. Can you spell apple with me? Ready? A P P L E Apple Great job! I love apples and I think apples are Zippity Zap's favorite fruit. They're so healthy and delicious. Did you know that apples can come in different colors? Yeah! Check this out. Besides the red apple, apples can be green and even yellow. Do you know how many apples I got here? Count them with me. One, two, three. We have three apples. Very good. But I have a customer who wants to buy a yellow apple. Do you remember which one is the yellow apple? Right again. Okay, so if we take away one yellow apple and bag it up for the customer, how many apples do we have left? Let's count. One, two. Two apples left. So if we have three apples and take away one, we have two. Because three minus one equals two. Great job and thanks for helping. Do you know what fruit this is? That's right, a banana. Can you spell banana with me? Okay, ready? B-A-N-A-N-A. -A -N -A. Banana. <laughs> and what color is this banana? Yeah, yellow. Zaptastic job. Bananas are so tasty and are very healthy. Okay, I need your help again. A customer is here and wants to buy four bananas. How many more bananas do I need to get to four if I'm starting with this one here? Hmm. What if I add one banana to the one we already had? Does that make four? Let's count. One, two. Hmm, nope. So adding one banana gave us two bananas. I think we need to add more bananas to get to four. Let's add another banana. Is that four? Time to count. One, two, three. Hmm, that's not four. What if we add one more? Let's count again. Ready? One, two, three, four. We did it. So if we add one banana and add three more bananas, we'd get four bananas. Because one plus three equals four. Great job, kiddos. Here's our next fruit. Do you know what fruit it is? Yeah, it's an orange. Can you spell orange with me? Okay, ready? O-R-A-N-G-E. Orange. <laughs> and what color is it? <laughs> yes, it's orange. And orange is orange. Now let's do some subtraction with oranges. Here we have three oranges. If a customer comes and buys two of these oranges, how many oranges would I have left? Let's count the remaining oranges. One. We have one orange remaining. Great work. Because three minus two equals one. <laughs> now let's have fun with this fruit. Do you know what fruit this is? Yeah, grapes. Can you spell grapes with me? Okay, ready? G-R-A-P-E-S Grapes! <laughs> look at these grapes! They look like they make a certain shape. What shape do you see? Oh yeah! I see a triangle! Let's count the sides. One, two, three! Three sides make a triangle. Nice job! What about a single grape? What shape does a single grape look like? It's round, so what shape is round that looks like a grape? A circle! Right again! Now let's count how many grape bunches I have. 
Let's count. One, two. Two grape bunches. Now I have two bunches of grapes, but I got a delivery for three bunches of grapes. So if I add the three bunches to the two I already had, how many bunches of grapes do I have? Let's count. One, two, three, four, five. Five bunches of grapes, because three plus two equals five. Amazing job, kiddos. Today, we counted, added, subtracted, and learned about some shapes with our favorite fruits. Math is so much fun when we do it together. Well, I gotta go, but I hope you've come and spend some more time learning with me. All you have to do is spell my name in the search bar. Ready to spell my name with me? Okay, Z-A-P-P-Y. Zappy! Remember friends, math is all around us and learning it can be fun and delicious. Keep practicing with your fruits and you'll be a math superstar in no time. Time for me to zap on out of here. Bye friends! Hey kiddos, don't forget to tell your parents or a grown up to subscribe.